For parents of people with neurocognitive differences like autism, self-care is often a back burner issue. In our Mental Health Monday segment, KCAL's Pat Harvey shows us how young adults are gaining independence and their families are finding support. Okay, so Aaron? Yes? It's a Monday afternoon and Lulu's Snack Shop is open for business at the Help Group campus in Sherman Oaks. Annalise, 20, introduces the team. I'm Aaron, Ben. Hi, Ben. ben. Hi. <laughs> and this is Eric. So yeah. yeah. Hi. I'm looking for a salty snack. Jerry Rockman is director of Advance LA, a program that helps young people who are neurodiverse transition into adulthood something parents and caregivers can't do without help. The word they often use is they'll say stuck. My, my young adult is stuck. Maybe they graduated from high school, but they're not moving forward, or they have a college degree and they're unable to find employment. A lot of parents just feel very alone. A sentiment shared often in virtual support groups. Another sentiment. Some people have a, have a really hard time asking for help. But asking for help, taking a break is essential. When you need it, you just have to ask before you, you know, you just go under. Respite care is often available free for families, and there is coaching for clients to increase independence. There's 25 size, and the price is $15. Fantastic. Kyle Kerfoot runs the work experience program. Bella and Raymond have jobs in the campus thrift shop. Oh, it's a little rip on it. And see if some of the other groups can sew them up. I sew and I'm really good at it. We can push them as far as their potential allows them to. While well, Raymond finishes the jeans, if you can check these bags up here and make sure okay. that they have tags as well. There is a setting and a work site for every student. The definition of success is different for everyone. Coaches here can help with all of it. Sometimes maybe going on a date is, is, a, is a form of success. Or hanging out with peers in a decked out RV. It helps them just feel a part of the world. Alleviating one of the most pressing concerns. Loneliness is a huge problem. But with coaching, support for their families and peers who share their struggles and victories, the future isn't as scary. Did you check all the shirts and dresses over yep, there? all set. And their parents? They're thrilled for their child to see them have the self-esteem, but it also alleviates some of their worries. What will happen to my child once I'm no longer around? I need to know that they'll be okay by tapping into services and support. Absolutely possible. Thanks for stopping by. And we have links to Advance LA and other mental health resources at our website, kcalnews.com.